Nothing like a little dirt in the face as you celebrate. This one is brought to you by DraftKings. Thank you for sponsoring the video. Astros were in the Bronx last week, and they had a three-run lead in the ninth inning when leading in the seventh inning. They're 30-1 and one this season, but stands in the box, and he's menacing. He's staring. He looks like out of a little kid's movie, what does the bad guy look like in the box? And Presley's scared, and he goes fastball low, fastball away, fastball low. The 3-0 fastball he pours right in there. Look at that. Right in there. Pours it right in there. That's a strike, and Stan says, yeah, throw that again. I dare you. Come on, throw it again. Throw it again, and Presley says, all right, yeah, maybe, maybe no, maybe I don't want to do that, and walk some leadoff walk. They're the death of you sometimes. In a three-run game in the ninth inning, not really. But now Glaber's up, and now Presley's like, I don't think I like that fastball anymore. Another ball, and after that, he's going to go off speed. He's going to go off speed. 3-2, he goes with the breaking ball, and Glaber does not chase. So now there's two on. A home run ties it. People are getting excited. Hicks is going through his head. He's thinking, all right, he just threw a 3-2 breaking ball. Because he didn't throw a single strike in the zone besides the 3-0. So maybe I should just sit breaking ball. And it looks very much like that's what he does, but he gets a fastball. That ball gets on him quick. You can see that he doesn't really transfer his weight until the ball is there. Like his foot's down, his weight's kind of balanced there, and the ball's past him. Now in this next one, you'll see it way more clear because he's still sitting off speed, gets a fastball, and he's way late. Just tries to spoil it once he realizes it's past him. He's like, all right, maybe I cancel my plan and I don't sit on the breaking ball anymore. Look at that. So you can see that his weight is shifting like there, but the ball's already on him. So he's just trying to foul that off or something because he got fooled. Then he's going to switch to the fastball and he gets the slider. You can see he's ahead of that. Because it feels like, to me, he changed gears. He's like, all right, I'm going to try and sit on the fastball now. Now, the 0-2 again, fastball way up. The 1-2 fastball clobbered. Three-run homer, and he no Damn, bro. Damn. That sucks for you. As much as it's awesome for me. Damn. And he's thinking, yeah, shit, damn. Damn, not good. Woo! Super excited. He needed that. A little bit of a slump. Big homer. And look at Trevino. Just the heart of the team. Look at him smiling like he's a a little kid. Just so excited. Soaking it in. Just like these guys hugging the fan. Oh, these fans aren't loving it, though. Uh Uh-oh. That's not as fun. Here's the first pitch on the left when I believe he was sitting off speed. And then the last pitch on the right when I believe he was sitting fastball and just trying to jump it. It's pretty slight. It's pretty slight, but one of them he clobbers. Here's a slow-mo. So the leg kick comes up, and but you can see on the right side that his back weight, he's transferring it all to his back foot just way heavier than, than the first one, and he's able to get there quicker. Now... Isaiah counter is up. Presley's still in. It's a tie game. He's not throwing any more fastballs. That was off-speed, 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 kind of reaches. Off-speed pitch to Trevino, who was trying to bunt him over. Another off-speed pitch. Maldonado wants it, doesn't get it, 1-1. That's a fastball. He steals. They say, you're out. It goes to replay. Yankees say, we're going to challenge that. Bob Costas shouted me out on the network and said, what do you guys think? This is so tough. It's really tough because watch, if I go frame by frame, you're going to see right there, it looks like the bag has moved. So if you just put your eyes right on the base and you can see it kind of bubble up right there. And has he tagged him yet? Now look at the glove and it looked like he hadn't yet, but that's not that scientific. This shot had both of them in the same thing and... It's so tough to tell. Like, is he touching the base there with his cleat? I don't know if we can say for certain. And then he does touch him with his glove. And that shot where you can see them both in the same thing, I have no idea. So they just got to go with the out on the field. After review, the call on the field stands. The runner's out. Bullshit. Fucking didn't. I don't know what he says. Fucking not. 
Didn't like it. But then another off-speed pitch to Trevino, and then another off-speed pitch to Trevino, or breaking ball, I should say. Breaking ball, breaking ball. Another breaking ball, and he sits on it because Presley, you, you can't throw there's that many. You just can't throw that many. So they're like, they take him out. Like, okay, dude, not a great job by you, but you'll get him next time. So they bring in the Pirate, and now he's got to face Gallo. And one, two, and three. Okay, and now he's got to face DJ. And DJ has himself a good at bat. Swings through the slider there. Didn't like it. Does not swing at the fastball. Fouls off that fastball. Two strikes. Doesn't swing at that one. Oh, did he go? No. And leaves that one outside. Maybe that gets called by some umps. This ump didn't. So now Aaron Judge comes up. MVP for the Yankees season right now. They go talk to him. And I'm going to guess. I, I, I have the benefit of knowing what happens. But I'm going to guess they say, hey. Let's not throw this guy a fastball. This fan is thinking, I don't think this is going to be fun anymore. Ball away. Ball low. Nice pitch, though. Ball low. Judge ain't biting. So what's he going to throw here? Is he going to throw the 3-0 fastball? Does Aaron Judge have the green light? Those are all the questions going through everyone's mind. I actually filmed myself watching this live, and I, I saw at the end, I didn't think Judge was going to swing, and then they showed a close-up of his face, and I was like, oh, I think Judge is swinging. Is he going to get a fastball? He gets a split finger change and says, don't care. Throws it in the left field. The Yankees come back. They score four in the ninth inning to walk it off against the Astros. Marwin's out to celebrate. Kiner's out. The bubblegum shower is coming by Nestor. He does that. And then Josh Donaldson scoops up some dirt and tosses it in Rizzo's eye. <laughs> which is an interesting celebration. At first, I thought he went to scoop up some pieces of bubble gum. No, straight dirt right at Rizzo, and then there's a bubble gum thrown here. I thought it was going to hit the back of Gallo's head. It doesn't. I think it hits Stanton's arm, but I think that's Sebi throwing the bubble gum. But we'll watch it again. Dirt, scooped. Rizzo gets his hair, maybe his eye. A weird throw by Sebi, and then Josh Donaldson laughing because he threw dirt. And that's funny. And that's funny. Judge getting dapped up all over. What a good job. Good job. Says hi to the fans. Says what's up. Stanton, smiley. Bam! Rizzo with the elbow. Glaber's going to come over. He's cute. And now the hitting coaches are all over Hicks. And I like this. Because he's having a rougher season. He needs some hits. And look at the hitting coaches. Look at the happiness there. Two hitting coaches. Hicks came through big. They're making sure he gets the love. High fives galore. Boom. 3-0. Splitter, don't care. Fuck yeah! This one was brought to you by our good friends over at DraftKings. Thank you for sponsoring the video. We appreciate you.